First off, we test the core and test OK. Then we test the commutator, bar to bar, test OK. Then we put the equalizer in. Run the commutator and test OK. Test bar to bar with the comb. Test OK. OK. Now we side the insulation paper in each slot. Just as free. Free as we'll ever be. All the insulation going to the slots. Now we slide the core into the slot and we connect it to the wind we connect the winding to the commutator bar Okay. Just as free. Now all the bottom coils are in the commutator. Free as and we begin to put the top coil into the commutator. Okay, now all the wire is in the slot. And it connects to the commutator. Okay, now then it's trimming the excess paper, insulation paper coming out of the slots. And this paper will later be folded and cover by a paper strip. Holding the insulation paper to the core. And after that, we have the strip. All the top set insulation is on top of the core. Being just knocks it down, make sure everything is down all the way. Okay, now we have wrapped the armature with the fiberglass bending. Uh, we go around the um, armature and connection, and we go around the top stick to secure everything in place I got my toes in a while, um, again in this the is uh, fiberglass bending and it secures and Life's insulates the winding and keeps everything in place okay uh, we're testing the DC armature Concrete cars of their own prison bars like this life I'm living in. But the plane brought me farther. I'm surrounded by now all the winding has been welded to the commutator. All the way around. The equalizer is at the bottom. Okay. Now the armature is going to the baker's oven. It's gonna be baked for preheat at 200 degrees before it gets dipped in the varnish. Okay, 
now the armature is uh, coming out of the oven 200 degrees and it's gonna cool down to about 145 degrees before it goes into the dip tank okay now uh, the armature is at a uh, 